Hi, AJ. Thank you very much for joining us today. And uh, here we're for, with Father Richard in our show. And uh, I heard you have some concerns or questions you, you wanted to present today. Yeah, hi, Father. Um, thanks for having me on. It's, um, it, I'm in college, so, so I think that's kind of the context of most of my, of most uh -huh. of my issues at the, at the moment. But, um, but I really want to like, help share my faith in college. And recently I've been trying to pray with my friends. Oh, um, good. And so, uh, so I, so I got some of my friends together to pray a rosary um, for my grandma who's in the hospital. Um, Great and idea. then some of them really weren't very interested. So then I just asked them if they'd pray, right, like if they'd pray some smaller prayers with us beforehand. Um, is, do you think that was, do you think that's okay? Like to, to kind of down, downgrade the, uh, the amount of prayer that you're doing for the sake of getting more people involved um, or would it be better to kind of like, I don't know, stick to your guns about doing the, doing the big thing that you were meant to do like a rosary. Well, I think it's a good idea to um, what, what you suggested is a good idea, you know, to say, okay, I would like to include my friends in my prayer. It's a good thing for them. Community prayer is powerful very powerful, more powerful than the same prayers said individually. So, uh, yeah, we'll we can try to get them, at least to get them to pray, you know, to get them to pray. Now, then you can pray more on your own. Yeah, um, absolutely. I think uh, it has to be gradual. So some people are not maybe mm -hmm. ready uh, mm -hmm. for that. So you can get them to pray, um, you know, a, a decade of rosary or something. Uh, right. and that's good. Uh, but uh, now that you mentioned, you know, praying the rosary with others, uh, this uh, wonderful quote from um, uh, this book, um, you know, The Secret of the Rosary by uh, St. Louis uh, de Montfort says oh. that uh, when we pray in community, uh, when we pray the rosary with others, we are praying as many rosaries as people there are, right? So... You pray the rosary to, with 10 people, it's like praying, it's as powerful as praying 10 rosaries at the mm -hmm. same time, right? So, Beautiful. you know, I thought that that's a, a good um, a good comparison to think about how good it is to pray it in community with us. Right, and that's why yeah. uh, the grad, being gradual is important, and then also to see... In your conversations, apart from that moment, to see what's their feedback, who is more interested in doing some more, who would be interested in doing a time of adoration, who would be interested in going to Mass with you. And sometimes you can't get everyone to go to everything, right? So mm -hmm. this group of five people will pray a decade of the Rosary. The, this group of two people may come to adoration with me. This other person may come to Mass with me. And then you, you have to see how they respond. Right. And maybe little by little, the one that if you talk to them a little bit more, the one that prayed a decade, maybe after a while he understands, you know what, I, I really appreciate you encouraging me. I think we can pray two decades, you know, and to mm -hmm. state this principle that Father Richard said to them, to yeah. let them know that the prayer that is said in common and especially the rosary is very powerful before God and to overcome temptations and to obtain the graces that we need. All these things are you need to convey the ideas that you have in your mind and in your heart to them because they don't know exactly all what you know, you know. And uh, actually, we're, you're getting more feedback now than they are. So I'll listen. Yeah, to right. Them. And what kind of and what kind of uh, ways can do you think you can include like Protestant friends who definitely want to pray with you, but they don't know all the same. Like they don't have the same prayers. Most a lot of Protestant friends that I know they like to pray rather like charismatically, so they just kind of say. They just have they just have spontaneous prayer mm -hmm. that um, that I think is is fine and good. But then my Catholic friends and I definitely want to lift up like a rosary or something mm -hmm. like that. Would it be like if if it's something that doesn't seem to be meshing well? Would it be good to just pray separately with those separate groups or make bigger efforts to bring everyone together to pray together? Because you were saying that like when people pray to get together, like like ten people praying a rosary, that's like praying ten rosaries. Right. Surely there's like power in having many people praying together yes but it, it doesn't seem to be the same format all the time with someone who's calvary chapel and someone who's let's say yeah you know. well I, I think um you know you have just make different different groups exactly. um and um yeah 
uh, also, you know, it's um, uh, something to tell them is, well, their father, uh, Jesus taught us, and it's a made-up prayer if you want, right. it's not, and it's pretty powerful, right? So both things are good, you know, they may, maybe they they reject a little bit the made-up prayers, but, um, you know, they're powerful too. Right, and then uh, occasionally, if you have already your rosary group going, uh, you <laughs> can let your one or two friends say, hey, you know, today we're praying the rosary if you want to come. And then let it up to them. Don't, don't be pushy, right? right? But yes, mm -hmm. give them the opportunity. But if someone, someone may say, you know what, I'm going to give it a try. I, I, what is this thing that these guys do? And they come and see, and they see it's biblical. It, it's based on the mysteries of the rosary, that, of the gospel, of the life of Christ, and that you have a prayerful d uh, attitude, and they join you. Mm -hmm. right. Very good. Well, yeah, thank you very much for, for joining us then today with this question. I, I think it's a very useful thing to, uh, to get feedback on, and uh, I hope it goes well with you in the future with your friends. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. All right, God, God bless, bless you, AJ. Take care. God bless you. Bye.